Hello guys, welcome to Shifan PUBG Mobile. Today, we have something special. The gaming phone Red Magic 5S just arrived. If you are new to my channel, I'm a competitive PUBG Mobile player for Nova Esports in North America. In this video, I'm looking into the gaming aspect of Red Magic 5S and help you guys decide if this phone is worth buying for mobile gaming. If you consider getting one after watching my video, Make sure you check the link in my description down below, as it supports me and my channel. Okay, let's jump right in. The first thing I'm going to show you guys is how much benefits higher FPS and the screen refresh rate can bring to your mobile gaming experience. Let's take PUBG Mobile as an example and watch this comparison. The higher the refresh rate, the smoother the visuals. Besides that, you can shoot your weapon faster. For example, all the iPhones right now have 60Hz display and the max game frame rate setting is extreme, which is 60fps. While Red Magic 5S features a 144Hz display and you can set a PUBG Mobile to 90fps. Testing two phones right now. As we can see, my M7 shoots 4 bullets faster on Red Magic 5S compared with my iPhone 11 Pro Max. For shooter games like PUBG Mobile, if you own a 90fps device, then you can kill enemies playing on 60fps device faster, which can bring you a big advantage in fights, and it's basically cheating. Before I play on Android device, some friends of mine are saying that Android phones touch screen are not as responsive as iPhones. After a few days of using Red Magic 5S, I can confirm this is not the case with this phone. Testing the recoil control on both phones using fingers only. Another key factor of mastering mobile game is utilizing gyroscope. Let's try again with using gyroscope only. As you guys can see, gyroscope on Red Magic 5S is as responsive as it on iPhone. Overheating is a common issue on phones when we play mobile games. You may experience FPS drop, scream dimming, and in some extreme cases, you can't even play because the phone is too hot and laggy. Personally speaking, I always have a desk fan running all the time when I play on my iPhone to keep it cool. But the drawback is that sometimes my hands got too cold when I play. Luckily, 
For Red Magic 5S, the cooling solution is the built-in turbo fan. The fan automatically kicks in when I enable gaming mode. During my time playing, I didn't experience any overheating issues as I mentioned above. However, if we do turn on game enhancement modes, the phone got hot really quickly. So if you are trying to push the phone's limits, I would recommend you guys to get your eye stock to cool your phone properly. Another factor people tend to miss when picking a gaming phone is the weight. As a competitive player, I need to hold my phone straight up and play 8 to 10 hours per day, which causes fatigue on my wrist. Heavy phones will put more stress on it. Red Magic 5S is weighted at 216 grams, while the iPhone 11 Pro Max I'm using right now is weighted at 224 grams. 8 grams difference is huge. I can instantly tell it's lighter when I'm playing on Red Magic 5S, and it puts less pressure to my wrist as well. However, lighter phone does come with trade off. The battery is at a 4500mAh, which is decent, but there are other phones out there with bigger battery. If you like to play games on the go without charging, this may cause you some problems. But if you are able to charge it with 55 watt charger, from 1% to 100%, it takes only 34 minutes, which is quite impressive in my opinion. Overall, I do have a positive experience with the Red Magic 5S. It gives me similar gaming experience, if not better to my iPhone 11 Pro Max, which is almost two times expensive. I do appreciate they have a headphone jack, unlike my iPhone, but it's a gaming phone, and I do hope they can change the position of the charging port, or come up with some solutions. Because as a hardcore mobile gamer, I use four fingers when I play, and also charge it at the same time quite often. The charging cable just got in my way when I play, which is not comfortable for me to hold the phone. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. 
Let me know what you guys think about the Red Magic 5S. And if you want me to come up with Android phone exclusive game settings, write your comments down below. See you guys in the next one. Bye.